Hey, good afternoon. Welcome. My name is Jim Davis, and I'm here in the Fluke Network's Technical Assistance Center. Today we're going to be talking about one of uh, a new feature, if you will, that is going to be available in our new HDR Optifiber OTDR module. Now, this is a firmware upgrade, and it's also going to apply to our existing Optifiber Pro product. And this adjustment is what we're calling expert manual mode. And expert manual mode is a faster way for you to make adjustments while you're trying to tune in the OTDR, if you will, to give you a good trace. Now, looking here in our expert module, I'm expecting to see an eight port splitter and it's not there. I need to make an adjustment either to my averaging time, the pulse width, perhaps the range that I'm working with. If I jump over to the trace here, I can see the trace and I can see where I got to my splitter, but after the splitter, that noise suggests that I'm not using a, a large enough pulse width. So in the expert manual mode, I can jump to setup here, change the pulse width or the range if needed, and the averaging time, and rerun the test without having to back out and reconfigure a manual test. This is going to make it faster for your technicians to work with our OTDR. And we're testing this in real time. <laughs> One of the things I like is we're checking the quality of the port of the OTDR. Very important that we have good quality there. It's a window. It's glass, if you will. And if the window isn't clean, we can't see out of it. All right, let's see. Hey, look at that. Now my eight port splitter shows up nicely here in the middle. I could even measure the loss of that if I wanted. And I can see I've got a good length of fiber after. Great. Again, this feature is available not only for the new HDR module, but for the existing Optifiber Pro OTDR modules. Thank you very much for watching. My name is Jim Davis, coming to you from the Fluke Network's Technical Assistance Center in lovely Everett, Washington. Thank you very much. If you have any questions, please, comments, place them below here.